Well, talk about um, you know having a day in in DC and uh, coming straight here from there, and uh, maybe having a, a little bit of time to kind of re-energize. And what's a what's a huge game, uh, not only for you guys uh, to get back in the win column, but the the you know the Canadian uh, Derby, the rivalry. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it was just time to kind of um, recharge the batteries, get everybody as um, as fresh as they can be, and ready for this game, which, as you said, is a very big game tomorrow. Good to have Daniel back. Well, of course, you know, and um, you know, another guy that that um, obviously we missed the other night. Um, you know, probably probably is a bit too far. When you look at the goals; they're pretty soft goals that we conceded, and probably wouldn't have conceded if if we had our regulars back in there. Um, you know, um, but you know that's life at the moment. So at least we get to kneel back, and we and we look forward to the other two coming back soon. Yeah, injury concerns heading into Montreal. Um, a few legs and pains normally after a game, but um, I think come kickoff time we'll be right. Facing a, a, an old foe, I know there's one player on uh, on uh, Montreal that's probably going to want to do well and against his old team in, in Izzy Nakajima Farron. Well, of course, but um, you know, yeah, you, you do that with every team that you when you when when players trade away or train. But probably can be said that Colin Warner is probably wanting to do very very well against Montreal as well. What do you tell the guys? Uh, you know, after you know the, the World Cup break and and the, the the tough little bit of time that Sean FC has been through to be able to mentally keep them, you know, uh, positive uh, coming into this game. Well, again, you always have a wee bit. Um, yeah, you know, all seasons are roller coasters, especially when you're kind of putting together a new team. And you're always going to have your ups and downs. It's just how quickly you can get out, get out of those downs and how, how how much you can ride the highs. And um, so we want to we obviously want to correct this as soon as possible. And um, what better chance than so? Your thoughts on the the changes uh, to Montreal, as far as uh, Nick DeSantis is concerned, and giving the the, the director reins to to uh, Frank Lopez and uh, and then bringing in uh, Dilly Duca. Yeah, I mean, uh, Dilly's a really good player, um, but you know, I think Niasi went the other way, didn't he? And he was always a dangerous player. So, um, you know, whatever happens behind the scenes um, in Montreal is not really my business. Um, we've got <laughs> enough on my plate to to worry about in Toronto, let alone uh, Montreal. Okay.